I'm Mark Squibb, Chairman of the Whole Health Research Alliance. This presentation is about the beneficial effects of beta electron exposure, also known as radiation hormesis. Medicine rocks have a 3,000 year history in native culture, and we believe the technology dates back to the Navajo, who observed that exposure to certain natural stones produced rapid and significant healing. We assert that life on Earth has evolved to tolerate and even exploit moderate environmental radiation to support health. The chapters that follow provide three new views of how biological immunity is energetically driven. First, we discuss the loss biology of alpha and beta lipid conjugation. Second, we propose an antioxidant effect of free or drifting electrons. And finally, we expand Dr. Petkow's research to the suppression of gestational pathogens. This presentation starts out with a few rational assumptions and goes from there. First, radiation politics are misleading. If all radiation was really that bad, we'd already be dead. Second, life is inventive. Any environmental influence, including radiation, will be utilized for the benefit of life. Third, too much of a good thing is a bad thing. There are five practical levels of radiation. Not enough, just right, too much, bad and ugly. 